welcome back to my channel how's everyone doing um i always try and do like a really big good intro at the beginning of my videos but i end up doing like four takes and never ever getting it down so i've decided not to bother trying to do an actual intro now i just don't think it comes naturally to me some of you have great intros and you say it word for word every week and i think oh you're so organized with this um but yeah it's not for me excuse me if anybody just heard that my tap just started leaking just give me one second <sighs> we're off to a great start already yeah um it was dripping not leaking by the way um but yeah so many of you do great intros and i can just never get mine down so i'm just gonna come on and say hi i hope everyone's doing well if you are new welcome if you're returning welcome um yeah let's get into it um, I'm off work this following week now, so I don't need to put anything into travel, yay. Um, so that money is going to go elsewhere, and you'll see where. But first, we will do our coins. We'll get that out of the way. So pennies, I have one. So we now just have 64p. Two p's, I have 4p. So we've now got 54p. Five peas, I have one, so £2.25. Ten peas, I have one, so £1.90. I don't have loads this week, do I? Um, 20 peas, I have £1.20 again. I seem to get £1.20 all the time. So that's what? That's £5.60. We're over halfway now for the 20 peas, which is good. Um, 50p is a half one, so that's £3.50. And then pound kinds of half one, so that is five. How much have I got in there now then? So I've got five, eight pound fifty, thirteen, fourteen, ten, fifteen, ten, sixteen, eighteen, twenty five. 1879, 19, 43, 19 pound 43 between my change. So that's pretty good. That's pretty good. I can't argue with that. Anyway, I'll just pop that into the pot and then we can move on. Um, I do have some new bits to show you this week which I'm very excited about. You can already see a little teaser of it right here. Let's count the money first. So we have 50. 70, 90, 110, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 190, and 195, 200, 205, 210. So let me show you what I've got my giveaway prize from the bell budgets arrived this week um i won a 10 pound voucher that i could use anywhere i liked i could um she'd send me the voucher out for anywhere but i thought i'd be really cheeky and ask her if i could use it in her shop i thought it was the best excuse to um try some savings challenges i don't know if anybody else has been like me but i um I second guess everything and I I struggle to make decisions because of that. So my, my problem is I'll see something, I'll think I love that, but then it'll go around in my head, you know, am I going to use it? Am I going to like it? What if I don't like it? Am I just wasting money? Blah, blah, blah. So I thought this was going to be an amazing way to test out um, some savings challenges for myself. So I messaged her and I just said, um, I've won the £10 voucher, thank you so much. Is there any chance that I could just get like a selection of your savings challenges up to £10 worth? Um, I'm happy with any of them. 
and it, she was so kind, um, Laura, she offered to also put some um, envelopes in there for me. So this is what I got. How pretty. I absolutely love them. They look so good. And um, so I've done a bit of a change around with my binders. All the envelopes that I've made are in here. These are all the ones from Laura LaBelle Budgets. So I kind of went for more long-term stuff um, it, with the plan of making this into a um, an annuals binder, if you will. So we have holiday. We've not got anything booked at the moment, but we are looking for something for next year. So I thought this would be perfect. Um, this is one of the savings challenges that she sent to me. It's a five pounds one. I think it saves about 300. Um, I tried to count them up and I don't know if I did my maths right, but I think it does about 300. So I thought that would be a really good way of just starting me off. We've not got anything booked yet, but if I can just keep putting into this, then it's building up at least. So that's the first one. I'm so excited to get stuff in these. Um, Christmas, which I already moved my the money that I had in Christmas over because I really, really wanted to see what it looks like with the placeholders and the money in there. And I love it. Um, I love it so much that actually I'm going to order some more. Um, so Laura, if you're watching, I hope you've got some more of this pink card in stock because I definitely do want to order some more of these ones from you. Um, emergency fund, which I'm going to be starting. I um, I've never prioritised an emergency fund. Neither me or James have. So this is going to get us kicked off for it. Not saying it's going to be filled very quickly, but it will be filled. Um, it's even given us more of a kick up the bum because last week we had a dental emergency. Um, so we ended up spending almost £90 out of the money we'd saved for driving lessons. Um, so we are going to be restuffing what we've spent out of that over the next couple of weeks. Um, but it's it's mainly coming from what we would have been putting into things like beauty for haircuts or um, lads night, things like that. Um, so it will get stuffed, but it's just, we're, we're okay for it to hold off for a couple of weeks. But emergency, I am so excited to get started with that. Um, council tax, so I want to start saving to pay the council tax annually. Um, so that's what this is going to be for. We're just going to try and save up. I won't be able to do it this year to pay it annually, but I thought if we could spend um, the next 12 months, 13 months, um, building it up so that we can just pay it off all in one go, that would be the most amazing feeling. Same with TV licence. We're just going to stuff that at some point to do it annually, to pay it annually. Um, and then that way I don't have to worry about it. I can just, I can just snowball it. I love seeing these annuals that people snowball. Um, it just seems to make so much sense. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And car insurance. Now, some of you might be looking at that thinking, aren't you getting a bit ahead of yourself because neither of us can drive and we don't have a car. Um, but car insurance is expensive and you know, it's going to be a little bit more expensive for us being first time drivers, new drivers, even though, we, you know, we're not like 18 year old boy racers or anything. Um, but I thought, what's the harm in getting a kickstart on it so that when we do come around to getting it, we might be able to pay that off annually as well. So it's not a monthly thing that we're having to pay off. We can just pay for it all in one go. Um, I thought, you know, why not? So, yeah. I'll probably end up using this before to maybe, you know, save up for a car, pay the rest of the driving lessons off, that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, this will be for car insurance. I just want to pull it out some nails as well. Like, I really, really need to take them off. Um, but I don't want to go into the shop to take them off because I know that I will... I'll crack and I'll end up getting new ones put on and that. I just want to give them a little rest for a bit. 
Um, one of them came off last night, as you can see. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try and take them off today. So they will be gone. I'll just have my nails. Um, yeah, and I'm just gonna let them breathe for a little bit. Okay, and the last one, which I'm super excited about, is I have a dice challenge, which I love watching these. Absolutely love watching these. So. There we go, one to 10. It saves 275. This is my beautiful little dice. Love it. Um, so yeah, we're gonna be doing this for the first time today. My spendings um, out of my pocket money for the week that I get is a tenner. Me and James just do a tenner each. And honestly, it usually goes on rubbish. Um, so I'm quite happy to be putting, even if it's the full 10 pounds of my spending money, in. I don't mind that at all because at least it's going to be saved up for something. I don't know what we're saving for yet. Um, I'm just going to save it. I'm just going to save it and when it's full we will decide where it's going but I am so excited to get that started today. So yeah that is my new setup from Labelle Budgets. A huge huge thank you to you Laura um, for for making these for me for offering to make those i was so happy with the savings challenges so the fact that you've gone and made me the envelopes as well is so kind of you and um, so yeah a huge thank you and i imagine all of you watch the channel but if any of you don't watch the channel go and watch it she's fantastic um and her etsy shop is La labelle uk i think um, but I'll leave a link in the description box because yeah, she does amazing stuff. Oh, I also, just as I forgot about this one. This is the little like freebie um, that you get. So yeah, Labelle UK. She's on Instagram, TikTok, YouTube and Etsy. Um, and the Etsy store is Labelle UK store, if you can see that. Oh, let me focus. Anyway, yeah. So that's what that is. Um, yeah, and this was just a little freebie that she gave. Um, you just fill the stars in. It can be for any amount that you want. So what I've done is I have laminated it so I can use it more than once because why not? I like a little small one. So I think what I might do is I might make these just like five pounds each um for the first time and save it up and when it's full we'll maybe stuff that into something else um so yeah that's that one uh, right so let's get started then i've got a little cheat sheet over here we'll get started with the other binder first i think because i want to do the dice roll last okay So not everything is getting some this week. Let me bring you my shot. Beauty isn't getting anything and it doesn't have anything in it. So some of these we did have to um, totally like wipe out. We we tried to bring some from the envelopes um, for the emergency dental work last week. Some from the envelopes. Um, so we didn't spend too much from the driving lesson savings because I we, we did so well to save all that um, but it's just one of those things you know there was a broken tooth and it had to be fixed it had to be sorted so yeah that's what happened um so yeah some of them won't have the same amounts that they did last week and um, because we did have to use them basically for this so that's that's part of why we want the emergency fund um birthdays isn't getting anything this week but it has 10 pounds m um, clothes has nothing at the moment but we are putting £10 in I bought a, um, a Spider-Man outfit for my little boy last week so that's where that money went um, so we're just that's just got to be a regular thing that gets topped up date night now we are going to put a little bit into date night i've got a week off work as i said but james is working which is a bit rubbish but 
it would be nice to do something at the weekend so either on friday or saturday next week we're gonna go for a couple of drinks nothing crazy a couple of drinks in the pub so we're putting 30 in now and we'll probably take like 20 out of next week's pay or something like that maybe even before i do the cash stuff in so that's what will happen there events this is we're saving this for mother's day at the moment and we have 20 and 30 and we are going to be we're going to be putting 50 in so should we use the 50 pound knot in this one maybe yeah we we'll we'll use the 50 pound knot in this one that's now 50 and 16 there but we worked it out we've got another three paydays before mother's day weekend so if we put is that right or was it two anyway we'd end up with like 120 to 150 by mother's day weekend and um, that's the split between me my mum and james's mum so that's not too bad so that's now got 60 in there family fun family fun is getting 40 this week we have You know, I wouldn't say we've got a busy week planned, but I'd like to have that money there um, in case we do. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to put these back and we're just going to pull 60 out of there. So 20, 40, 60. Yay. So that's good. Um, so that just means that the money's there for if we do want to do anything. We were going to go for a walk around um, one of the local lakes today, um, but so far the weather's a bit rubbish, it's very grey, it looks like it's really going to come down with the rain, um, so we'll just have to see. My little boy's just having his nap at the moment, which is handy, so I'm going to do this, get all ready. Um, get ready to head out and then if it is nice we'll go. If it's not, we'll figure something else out to do. We can always do maybe soft play or anywhere. We can we can go and do anything. Um, Happy Mail is getting 10. We are just trying to save this up. Um, I really want to buy some ink. I thought my ink was going to be about 30 for the two cartridges, but I think that was just for one. I think I just remembered it wrong and it's more like 50 for the two that I want um so yeah we're just gonna save up so we've got 10 15 20 in there so far and we're just putting another 10 in so that's now 5 10 can you even see that 5 10 20 and 30. so that's good it's building up it's really really building up actually um, and I can wait, it's giving me a chance to, I'm actually going to get some designing done this week, that's that's my plan. Get some designing done so that I know where we're at, what I'm doing, um, and then when I do have the ink, I can just get to actually making stuff, which is exciting, it's really exciting. Health has got nothing in it at the moment and it's just getting five. Um, I just I like to put a little bit in that just in case we we need anything else. Home is getting nothing. Lads might getting nothing and it has nothing in it. I don't think I don't know it. Oh, home has five pounds in it. Just just so we all know. <laughs> Lads night has nothing in it and it's not getting anything. Mum's night or mum's club sorry. We didn't end up going um, this weekend. We're so terrible with making plans, but 
basically we have all been ill. My little boy was ill last weekend when we were arranging it in the first place and that got moved because people's schedules um, was too tight. This weekend I've been so ill all week, I've had the worst cold, I feel so much better now. I, I actually thought it was going to really hit when I got when I um, finished work for the week. So I was really grateful that it didn't and I'm feeling a million times better. Um, but yeah, all the other kiddies have had just random illnesses and there's been there's been a lot going on um, between us this past week. So we've we've decided to postpone it, but we will come back to it because I think some of us definitely need um I think we need to be around each other to, you know, get stuff off our chest and um yeah, just have a little catch up. So that's gonna happen. But for now we are fully funded at the forty pounds. Um I'm not gonna go over that because it doesn't need it doesn't need to be over forty. Readings, yay. So Ravings has 100, 150, 170, and this is getting 30. 10, 20, 30. So, if my maths is correct, we should now have 200. So, 150, 10, 20, 30, 50. So that's now 200 that we have for my little man, um, which is brilliant. I don't think I've got a 200 pound placeholder. That's gonna have to be fixed. Oh no. Right, well, that, that means I'm definitely gonna have to get back onto Iris's um, shop. So again, Iris, if you're watching, I'd appreciate it if you'd make some more 200 ones because I'm gonna be coming by in some of those this week or next week that would be fantastic um yep yeah, so that's that my friend's wedding no that's not right it should have more than that oh i had a little panic then so it has 50 65 we're getting another 15 today so I think what I'll do is I will change it up like this. So it's just the 30. So 50, 60, 70 and 80. We have a date for the wedding. It is close. Um, so yeah, I'm really gonna have to start putting money into this because there's gonna be things to pay for like Hendy, um, planning sessions, dress shopping, um, everything like that, and then the actual event itself. So I need to work out a real plan of action for this one. But yeah, we have 80 in it to start with. So going forward from there, we should be filling this up nicely. And travel is getting zero. I need nothing in there. Which is a nice feeling being able to put that money towards something else want to spend it on rather than a train service that doesn't work very well um okay holiday yay this is so exciting i get to color in my first tracker <clears throat> so we are doing 10 for this so holiday is getting 10 can you see that Yeah, you can see that. Oh, now do I go up or do I go down? Uh, sorry, do I go across or do I go down? Let's go across. I think we're gonna like spiral it in. Look at me colouring in the lines. Yay! That is very exciting. So. There we go, how good does that look? Yay, that looks great. Christmas. 
is just getting 10. So we have 50, 70, 5 and 80. And Christmas is also getting 10. We will do two fives. So five, 10, 15, 20, 40, and 90. Yeah, that's, that's not a bad start, is it? Not a bad start at all. You can see Cute. emergency. Emergency is getting ten also. We'll do the same so we're doing red for this one. This is a really good feeling actually knowing that although it's only ten pounds, you know, that is a start to my emergency fund um which is is really good it makes me feel like a real grown-up <laughs> yeah that's great oh i've just noticed the time on the video i'm so sorry that it's taken uh this long Council tax is getting nothing, TV license getting nothing, car insurance, nothing. Dice, dice, baby. So we just have the £10 left for die, 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 die. I can't speak at all at the moment. For dice, dice, baby. Um, yeah, so let's do it. Let's roll the dice. Let's see what is going in and see what I'm getting. I can't believe how excited I am to do this. Ready? Is that five? Yeah, five. Awesome. So let's let's call that in. Look at that. I'm very, very happy with that. Um, so yeah, we're off to a good start. Like I said, I don't know what we're gonna be spending this money on at all. Um, but I'm happy that it's been saved. Oh yeah, that's what I was saying. I'm gonna put the five pound note in um, and just stick the coins in my purse with hopes that they're still there at the end of the week and I can just put them into the pot challenge. But we'll see, we'll see. yeah that's that i hope everybody had a lovely weekend and is gonna have a good week yeah. so exciting um yeah everybody have a fantastic week um don't work too hard i will be enjoying the week with my boy um doing a bit of potty training but yeah lots of other fun stuff as well um so yeah i'm gonna let you guys go that's us my count up will be coming this week i'm also going to film my debt, coll debt collection i think i say that every time debt confession um so there will be a couple of extra videos to come soon um and yeah that's it from me i hope everybody has enjoyed this video please like it give it a comment um, and subscribe if you're not already subscribed i'd love to have you here um yeah and if you've got any awesome savings challenges that you think i might like let me know um because i'm definitely keen to get more i really enjoy coloring those ones in like the big kid i am um, but yeah that'd be great so thank you so much everyone and see you later bye